Hi guys, Steve Capose in Thailand. Just come out here today in the garden to do some work. Just filling up my Thai pot with more compost. I've got a whole load of mushroom compost over there. Been pulling out weeds. I've got four of these Thai pots and one day I'm gonna find where they make them and how they make them and I'll show you guys. Got my big concrete pipe that I'm still fitting up with material. I showed you that in a previous video. Just putting material in there, compost, leaves, grass, um, scraps from the kitchen and so forth. I walk back to the garden, just working away here. I've still got concrete pots here to, um, to fill up. I'm trying to make my own soil, so that's why it's taken a long time to fill up these pots, these tire pots and concrete pots. These ones are full lime trees. Um, this one here I'm still making, like trying to make like a compost sort of soil. So what I'll do, I'll walk over here and show you this massive mound of mushroom compost I've got. There's so much here to show you. And this is only our house. I mean, I can work here full time forever, basically. And we've got a massive pond here. There's fish in there, more banana trees. Here's the massive um, pile of mushroom compost. There's um, father walking past. He's working hard over here. Very tired as well. I gave him some water before. Anyway, that's the um, house. You can see how big the land is. And there's enough room here to keep me occupied. There's massive piles of timber here. I mean, anything you like is here. That's a tamarind tree. You can see the nice tamarind fruits. I mean, we've got everything. Mangoes, tamarind, banana trees, all soy like guavas. Steve Capozzi here in Thailand reporting live. So much work here to be done. And this is just a hobby, so, you know, do what I can, have a rest, have a sleep. No rush to wake up in the mornings. It's a great life. I want to stay busy, of course. What I'll do, I'll keep walking over here. I might as well show you the rest of the land. It's actually two blocks of land. This is one big block of land. And they brought the second block of land here next door, so... There's enough land here to build three or four big homes. And there's the pond we have. They are thinking about filling in this pond and maybe building a house here. What we call a resort we built. Sit there and have a rest. Lakeview Resort we call it. That's the back end of the, this land. There it is guys. Top of your trees. It's just got everything here and right behind someone else's land, basically rice fields. So we've got rice fields right behind here. There's more mountains up here. You can see the clouds coming in. It is quite warm. The new fence they built, this fence is okay, but over here, there was too much dirt up against the fence and it's broken. Let's keep walking along here. Good chance to just show you the rest of our land. The house is behind there. I mean, this is like a farm in itself, but this is not the farm. You'll see on my YouTube channel videos from the farm. There's a fence that broke. There's too much dirt placed up against it. And now they've laid these concrete foundations and with wire, they're gonna try and hold the fence in it was actually poor construction to begin with. Other people's land behind there. There's palm trees, coconut, bamboo here. You can eat the bamboo shoots. And this small shrine. Every Thai house has got like a shrine. I've got to fix it up and clean it up. You can see little figurines you make like offerings burn candles and so forth 
every Thai house has got a spirit, a spirit house basically where the spirits can live to keep the spirits happy otherwise they're gonna make trouble so you've got to have a spirit house I can talk more about Thai culture as I do videos there's another view there we are there's another view back here of Pu Ho 